Mrs. Peck? Mrs. Peck, I made a very poor introduction of myself to you. I know that. I'm a stranger in your house that you love, and I'm here to do something that's not very pleasant, so I don't expect you to like me, but I have feelings too, Mrs. Peck. Now, I'm sorry about being untidy. That's something that I can't control. That's a fault of mine that I, I, I don't know. I just can't correct that. And I, I've tried many years. I'm just very untidy. That's my nature. But I've never been on, I, I've never been rude to you, Mrs. Peck. And, and if you keep on treating me like I'm an enemy just because I'm here trying to find who killed the man that you worked for for 33 years, well then, well then I think you're a very unfair person. Lieutenant Colombo. Lieutenant, I know that you're a very hard-working officer, and I would like to offer you a plate of Mr. Paris's favorite health cookies and a glass of milk. Well, thank you. I'm extremely fond of health cookies. Nothing. Oh, the, the bell rang, and I let Miss Chambers in. She had a cab waiting. Maybe it was some little thing. I mean, really little. A noise, maybe. Well, the TV there went off for a minute. The TV went off? Well, it came back on again in, in a few seconds. It's not worth mentioning, except that the color hasn't been the same since. Oh. Well, you know, I'm an expert on fine-tuning. What I mean is, you know, I know what those repairmen get. Uh, see, I got stung a couple of times, and I went down to the supermarket, and I pulled one of those instructional manuals, and I really studied it up. So if you don't mind, may I take a look at this? Let me see what I can do for you. I uh, know. Huh? Uh, when the TV set went off, did the lights go off, too? Well, I didn't have any lights on in here at all. Of course, I don't know about the rest of the house. But it was only 20 seconds. It, I'm sure it wasn't. When was that, Mr. Speck? Do you remember exactly when it was that the set went fooling? Yes, I remember exactly because I was hammering on the TV, and I saw the clock, and it was 8.05 exactly. And Miss Chambers got here at 8.30. Mm -hmm. Boy, this thing really is out of whack, isn't it? But I'm going to be able to help you with it. You see, all you have to do is get the precise thing. Is... Oh, dear. Wait a minute. Oh, wait a minute. No, Miss Peck, I want you to remain calm. Oh, no, remain calm, Mrs. Peck. Just remain calm. This is just that goes back on very easily. This is part of the knob. You just tell the repair man to go right back. Yes, ma'am, I'm leaving. I'm Ouch! very happy to pay for this. Just say, Ouch! yes, ma'am, I'm going. Maybe the repair man. Yes, I'll leave it right here. Just one more thing. <laughs> 